at last. It's taken me hours to get this damn thing set up. It's the Handtech PC based oscilloscope and the logic analyzer. And I mounted it right here. I hope you can see. Let me see if I can get a bit of light on it. There it is, look. I think I might have to put a little bit of strain relief on this basket because it's sort of getting a bit heavy now. But as you can see, there's the two probes. Currently got them set onto the cali calibration square wave. The other tag is the ground. And these pins in here are the logic analyzer. So you can put jumpers on those and run them down and so on and so forth. I don't know how much I'm... Nah, maybe I'm use it, but it's been years since I've used a logic analyzer. And let me take this lights off the screw TV screen monitor. And here's the oscilloscope running on my PC. Showing the two calibration square waves, channel A on the top, channel B below. Um, well, looks pretty good to me. You can see, maybe you can see, there's a little bit of noise on the top and bottom. Sorry about that, but halfway through that, the batch just declared, I'm flat, screw you, no more, no more playing. Anyhow, as I was saying, it was a quick change of batteries. Channel A on top, channel B below. Um, all the appropriate, I don't know if you can make them out on here. See if I can try a different angle, how about that? All the different settings and so on. Obviously all on screen settings. Um, obviously as I just said a moment ago, only just got this running. So I haven't really done anything to like or dislike it. So we'll find out soon. Now let me close the oscilloscope down and open up the logic analyzer. And there it is. I guess it's a 16 channel as in channel 0 to 15 and each one of these can be connected to a logic state, obviously varying state, so that you can actually see what's going on in your logic, if that's logical. <laughs> um, don't know if I'll ever get to play with this. And also, as I should, said a moment ago, the pins are up here, and to get them down to my desk, might be quite a long haul for a logic analyzer, especially just burnt wires. I mean, the ones I've used was a Hewlett Packard logic analyzer, and that came with an amazingly screened um, coaxial cable for each channel. So I don't know how this will turn out. Hey kids. Um, anyhow, really pleased I got it running. So I'll have to patch these two videos together and see how it goes.